I love this. We had one a couple of months ago. This is the Toyota Pro Ace Family Premium. Top of the range, eight seater, tremendous looking car. 2017, 67 plate, 24,000 miles. And today with the live pricing, it's only 23,990. And what a tremendous car it is. The last one I had, genuinely, I could have sold 15 if I had that many available. Because they're so versatile, they just tick every single box. They look great, lots of space. Great winning cost being the two litre diesel. And it does, it ticks every single box. I love the colour, metallic brown, it looks great. Suits this car right down to the bone. You've got the front fog lights, the front big grills and bumpers. It is a facelift model, so it's a newer model with a newer headlights and the newer grills again. And as you come round here, you'll see you've got the colour coded bumpers. The upgraded diamond cut alloy wheels, which are two tone. That's diamond cut and ampersite grey. But then this one has things like electric seats. Full leather seats, and I mean genuine leather, not that plastic stuff. It is good quality leather. You've got heated seats, you've even got the massaging seat, so it gives you different options there. I mean, it's brilliant. Navigation, DB digital radio, and it's automatic with paddle shift, cruise control, flat bottom steering wheel. But remember, 24,000 miles, so the condition speaks for itself. The front two seats are like captain seats with their own sort of armrests there. Loads of cubby holes all over the vehicle, in the door pockets, down the sides, electric windows front and back, obviously. Sun protection glass, and then you have them sliding doors. And I have a few kids, so I love this, because for me, it's practicality. So if you're gonna use it for business, you can use it for family, if you've got a daycare or a nursery, whatever it is you do, even a child minder, this is perfect. Now the seat configurations, you can change it, you can take the seats out, so you can use it as two in the front, three in the back, and just have it as a five seater, and have lots of leg room. Or you can have this midsection down here and then you can literally configure it to whatever you want but then this being the top of the range premium family premium you've got that full double sort of pan roof air vents in the interior there so again everyone gets a nice experience and when you get out this car after a 300 mile journey or whatever it may be you don't get out feeling all rough and ready it's, it's perfect absolutely awesome off oh, the seats i'll quickly show you because it's so easy to use so you flip that down and it goes down there's a red handle here and you can literally slide the seats forwards and backwards where you want and to get in i mean that's so easy like i'll show you now it, it's absolutely brilliant i love this i love the whole sky the panoramic glass roof the twin blue glass roof like i said before about all these air vents three point seat belts for each passengers cup holders all over the place but what a great place it's high up as well easy to get in and out of because of the steps here great car and a great color absolutely love it and look at this so you've got an eight seater vehicle but then you've got you've still got boot space for suitcases shopping push chairs so not only have you got all the space in the foot but you've still got boot space because there's certain eight seaters out there seven seaters out there that once the seats are all in use, you've got zero boot, literally nothing, not even space for enough for one bag. So this one is quite the opposite. You've got the pulley there, pull it down with, or you just push it down like that. Over here, and you find it, give me two seconds, bear with me. Over here, I just need to find it, two seconds, there somewhere, there, these ones there. So press these, you have window access. So again, like the BMW Touring vehicles, you can literally drop a bag off. Because you've got quite a swing on the boot lid in a car park, if someone's parked close to you, or if you're in a, uh, an indoor car park, you can always open the full boot. So this is nice and easy access as well. Again, ideal. No dents, no scratches, rear parking sensors. The car is just genuinely a beautiful looking car. You've got sliding doors on both sides. Again, it's an obvious thing, but it's amazing how many times I've seen customers go and buy a van, convert them, put seats in them. And most panel vans only have one sliding door on one side. So this is not a van. All this is, looks like a van and the same size as a van. It's very, look, the luxury is in mind here. Other little things like the trays in the back. Like my kids would love this because if we're going for a, a nice long journey somewhere, they'd put a little drink there, some little snacks there. You can even put your iPads in there and, and do what you want to do. It's beautiful. Like I said, it's high up, so vision-wise, it's perfect. Push button start. A nice, quiet diesel engine. You've also got the heads-up display popping up there, as you can see the glass piece. So on the heads-up display, you can see the speedo, a lot of other useful information. 
all the stereo controls and everything are here. The paddle shift. But for me, 24,000 miles, even the new gear shift is quite quirky. So it's dead easy to use. Reverse, neutral and drive. When you finish back in P. Two keys. The car's absolute, it's a lot of car for 23,990. This spec, that's what I found last time. It was a spec that made it special. Everyone was going crazy over it. Because you do get them in other specifications without the leather, without the upgraded wheels, all the gadget and gizmos, the glass roof. But this has got everything. Not going to hang around. But like I said, business user, your private person, your family, big families, and if you want that extra space, it's a perfect car. My name's Joe. Thanks for watching. Bye bye now.